Red Lake Nation has officially sworn in their next leaders. Reporter Sherelle Moore is live tonight in our studio with a look at this morning's ceremony. Sherelle? Thank you, Dennis. Newly re-elected Red Lake Tribal Chairman Daryl G. Siki Sr. tells Lakeland News this was by far the toughest election he's ever faced. But now he's thinking positive and looking towards the future. The election was competitive and long, but the people of Red Lake have spoken, and they have chosen this group to lead them into the next four years. I'm glad it's over. Now it's time to heal the, the nation and my family. Chairman Siki Sr. was re-elected to another term as tribal chairman. Also re-elected was tribal treasurer Annette Johnson. Samuel R. Strong is a new face to the board. Strong will serve as tribal secretary and hopes to bring the voice of the youth to the table. I think that's the most exciting part about politics is that we have a chance to really shape our communities. Looking at the next four years, the team hopes to continue some of the initiatives that were already started. My goal, I guess, is to hope to continue what we started as well as to um, make more progress in areas such as our, our drug and alcohol epidemic. Continue the solar, solar initiative we're doing and solar paneling because it's at, at the end, end run in about five years, six years, it's, it's going to benefit the tribe. There are also a few new policies the board hopes to enact one day such as finding better ways to communicate and starting new programs for the youth and the elders. Making sure that we keep our way of life alive, that we look towards the future. I talked about enrollment being a major issue I'd like to address during my four years. We have to keep in mind that um, as indigenous people or Anishinaabe people that we have the future generations to look out for. Um, namely our youth um, as well as we can't forget our elders. They actually have instilled in us who we are today. And to help with communication, Siki Sr. has plans to start a Facebook page for himself as chairman to help clear up some misconceptions. Also, everyone on the board says they're looking forward to working together as a team. Dennis, back to you. All right, thank you very much, Sherelle, for that live report tonight from our studio here in Bemidji. Other positions which were sworn in today include the Red Lake, Ponema, Redby, and Little Rock representatives. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.